Hey everyone, it's Mindy Hahn, the Midwest Premier Sports Handicapper, coming to you from TonySpicks.com and the half of the morning show duo, The Morning Steam with Ramon Scott. Uh, but hope you enjoy this free pick video from our show. Uh, be sure to click in the link in the description for our best bets. Now here is the pick. And next we'll go out to the Texas Bowl where Mississippi is going to take on Texas Tech in this one. And right now Mississippi is favored uh, three and a half and the total 71 and a half. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be interesting to see how, you know, Mississippi here, you know, turns out in the next uh, couple years because they are so like, you know, transfer portal heavy. Um, you know, to me, that kind of tends to get teams into in, into trouble, kind of like a Michigan State where, uh, you know, they don't really want to go out and do the hard work, get in the recruiting, uh, just take their time in the transfer portal. Uh, so I think it's going to be, you know, like I said, I, I just think this Mississippi team has been interesting kind of all year long. To me, they've been like huge underperformers, um, you know, and I don't know why. I mean, it seems like they should have all of the, you know, uh, all of the talent in the world to produce big outcomes here. But gosh, I'm not so sure today. I like Texas Tech. They've won three in a row now. They're putting up 36 points a game. Ole Miss, you know, they lost their last, you know, three here, only scoring 24. Now, maybe you could say they play, you know, a little bit better, you know, competition perhaps or something like that. But, um, you know, Tech six and one against the spread in the last seven. I don't think you can complain about that. They also been putting up a lot of yards, uh, averaging about 450. I think I'm going to take Texas Tech. In this one, plus three and a half. Well, this is the Texas Bowl. <laughs> I think Texas Tech will have a bit of a crowd advantage here in this game. You know, Mississippi got off to that hot start. They played a weak schedule, though, and they finished weak. And they finished weak, right, with those uh, losses down the stretch, three straight losses. Yeah, it was Alabama. But it was Arkansas. It was Mississippi State. They didn't cover in those two games. They did cover against the Tide, however. But uh, Texas Tech, they won and covered their last three games. So in the Texas Bowl, I'm going to like Texas State. I think the coach did an excellent job there this year, considering the, you know the changes that were made. There were a lot of questions uh, regarding Texas Tech. So they, you know, defense is pretty weak. This total is pretty high. But, uh, yeah, you know, Dave, I, what do you think then I, if, you, if it's coming down uh, to motivation here? You have, I think, you know, the news is good for Texas Tech. I think McGuire's done a pretty good job this year. And, you know, Ole Miss, I mean, have, losing four of their last five after that, uh, you know, what was six or seven in a row to start the season against subpar competition. Hey, Mindy, want to say hello to Chad Jackson joining Mindy. us here. He's got fix, a series of plays uh, today. It looks like uh, in this uh, on the card today. So appreciate that Chad, a four pack of winners right there from Chad Jackson. Not sure we've had the pleasure. So uh, thank you. Rapper Capper says he wants to stick with the SEC right here. He doesn't want uh, anything. Alvin will pass on the game. And, yep. Yeah. All right, Mindy, uh, we're on Texas Tech here. We're taking the points going against our guy, but uh, that's okay. And we'll take those uh, three and a half points here. Yeah, we could have had a better uh, number here. Maybe we could add four, but let's go ahead and take Texas Tech here at three and a half. And, Mindy, I'll tell you what. Uh, I'm actually showing some movement. It's already going down to three at some oh, point. I hope we can get in there. But uh, the yeah, yeah, maybe we're just maybe. Who's watching this? Are we are we moving the line, you guys? <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Definitely action coming in. I'm showing a major Las Vegas book has moved to three. It's mostly three and a halfs across the board, but that uh, that hot book in Las Vegas is calling it at three right now. So. So thanks for watching and make sure you get over to the Tony'sPicks.com website right now and check out our All Cappers tab where you can purchase some of our own personal picks. And be sure to go ahead and use the promo code TONYT at checkout to save 20%. Okay, have fun. Watch another video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.